Well, I'm on the big island of Hawaii, and I'm going to shoot a sunset just north of Kona, area called Otec. It's right behind the airport, right behind the Kona airport. And there are these great lava tubes here where the, uh, when the tide comes in, the waves come in, the water fills up these lava tubes and empties out. It's a really cool effect. And you, uh, you catch the water as it's just starting to drain. You get a really nice shot. So I gotta wait about an hour still for sunset, but I gotta scout out locations and find one of these great lava tubes. And uh, we'll see what I can come up with. Okay, key things when shooting these lava tubes. One is you need a tripod. You have to go uh, and expose, you're probably close to a third of a second to really capture that movement of the water. Uh, secondly, I think you need a graduated neutral density filter because that sky is very bright and the lava and the lava tube is relatively dark comparatively. Um, and I use a remote shutter release as well just so I don't have to touch the camera and I can click off a shot. And then the positioning is you want to. I'm, I'm using a wide angle lens, it's a 16 uh, to 35 lens, and I try to get as close to the lava tube as I possibly can um, so I can capture the whole thing uh, and get some of the sky. Now, this is a little dangerous because this, uh, this wave, these waves can be pretty unpredictable. And sometimes the water comes in much quicker than you expect, that lava tube can really kind of erupt almost and you can get soaking wet or worse. So most important thing is to be very careful, which I'm being careful. So I'm gonna set up and uh, hopefully we get some great shots. 